Loki Twat here and today in this video we're going to be talking about Santa's penis is erect and it's squishy and someone squished all over it and spermed all over it and it was me no I'm joking I'm joking it was um DJ Keemstar fuck it I don't know Keemstar is addicted to coming on Santa Santa's squishy dick <laughs> anyway guys so today in this video we're going to be talking about Christmas overrated rate overrated it's stuff that's what we're going to call that and also no every relationships not a hundred percent apart from one these are the topics we're going to be talking about and we're going to be talking about where I've been so um, yeah so um, let's get started so and we're also going to say that the reason why I mentioned about Santa's erectum is because I just did you know what Lauren is Santa sitting with me this year but me and Santa Santa decided that he was he, no one liked him so he fucked off and I just and I was really upset about it so I took the pit I took the pit, mick out of his penis never seen it never seen it erect i just wanted to take the piss you know have a bit of a laugh mate that's what you do when your mate decides not to come on a video or as in enemy you take the mick out of his erect penis that you've never seen and call it squishy that's how that's what you do mate life tip from me anyway so let's talk about fucking Christmas because that's the top because it's Christmas time everyone having a jolly time no it's raining Luke I know it's raining like Christmas is a jolly time but it's pissing now like people say oh Christmas is a jolly time but when it's pissing down every day it's just depressing isn't it I'm not even telling a joke it just is like stop wetting on me and be sunny I don't even want it to throw what white stuff at me just be sunny yeah anyway so um you know some people are like oh my god christmas i can't wait for christmas oh my god it's gonna be so much fun i get to have loads of presents but but when you come to christmas you get bored but what do you expect? You're sitting with your family, not having a stag night. What's the... And people will really look forward to the food. Like, people will go, I can't wait to eat my turkey and that. But then you moan about the turkey, say, Oh, this turkey's so shit, Mum! Mum, this turkey's so shit! Everything's shit, I don't like it. She's like, tough. I don't fucking like it. I don't like Christmas. And for the whole day, you'd be moaning about how you don't like Christmas, how you hate your gifts. You'd be like, I can't wait to get all my gifts. Oh, you got me a shoe. Oh, you got me a um, a computer. That's shit. Oh. <laughs> it's shit now. So they go looking forward to it, going, yay! And then when it comes to the gifts, they're like, oh, this is boring, this is shit. Can I go on my Instagram and show tit pics and throw dog filters everywhere? This is boring. And they all just, so people get this hyped up about Christmas. And all Christmas, they're like this. Oh, this is boring. This is boring. This is boring. Mate. It's boring. And mate, if you got someone in your family, like a brother or a sister, that goes on about Christmas and doesn't shut up about it, and it's like, oh, Mr. Hyper. And then on Christmas Day, he's non-stop moaning about food and gifts, even though he's got like over £500 worth of presents. He's still moaning his head off because he thinks he's, because he thinks he owns the world because he's in year seven and wears Adidas, then, then I don't know. Like, just sorry for you, mate. I'm just, I'm just sorry for you. Like, it's just, it's just, bleh. 
So, my favourite part of Christmas, in my opinion, is definitely the holiday. And it's not as good as the other holidays, because as I've said, it's pissing down. And you know, I'm not at Norfolk. Maybe people go to caravans in the winter and not the summer in England. Maybe people like laying on the beach in the freezing cold. Doesn't attract me, though. I don't mean a sexual way! <laughs> and you guys... And I'm, I'm not on about digging holes for me and my girlfriend to fit in and hide underneath the sand while we oohing all night. That's a bad joke. That's, it, it's probably not even funny. It's just stupid. <laughs> anyway, so, um, yeah. So I know what you guys might be thinking. Luke, what are you on about? That there's this relationship that has got 100% happiness and no arguments because let's face it there's always every relationship's not perfect there's always some sort of shit even if it's the slightest shit say you called me fucking you said I'm a bit fat you said I was in the bathroom too long there's always a little bit but apparently Dr. Phil the, the scientist has been is in is in the um, outer space on one of them robot thingies and um, he has researched and he has now DNA'd every single person and he's found a weird match now everyone else's DNA is pink for love obviously but in this couple's DNA which is weirdly two men it's dark red sort of love no it's like dark pink sorry no um b before you say that's not fair on gay people it's not on gay people it's just this one couple and this couple doesn't even exist what i've heard of so i don't know what the fuck it where this has come from this couple is from mario and luigi what the fuck Mario and Luigi are apparently secretly going out with each other and they haven't had an argument yet. That's why Luigi's been pregnant. It's only a conspiracy theory. <laughs> That's right guys, Mario and Luigi have had sex, got married and had a baby. No arguments, no I don't fancy having sex tonight. Them two just got a psychological mind to know when to please each other, when to keep themselves happy. They've got that much in common, they don't piss each other off. One day maybe we find a woman that's like that, but I think more and more, if everyone went gay, there won't be any arguments, but apart from women, obviously, they always like an argument with their periods. <laughs> but, um, yeah, but... Um, the world will never be like that. And I'm not saying that all men are sensible, are um, not sensible, calm human beings, because there are some gay men and there is men that act gay and it's getting worse. <laughs> but, um, yeah. By the way, I'm joking. I'm joking. I don't want to get sent to the police. Anyway guys, I hope they enjoyed this video. I'm sorry I haven't uploaded for a while, but I haven't had any ideas until now. But um, yeah, if, if you guys have got any um, editing apps or anything that you want me to try, because I used to use viral videos, but they put a pay tag on it now, and it, I'm, I'm not paying that, 40 quid or whatever, it's just robbery. And um, yeah, if you guys got any ideas, because, um, it would be good to have some ideas, obviously, because then I can make more videos. Uh, I did want to make a new video, but I just haven't had any ideas, and I've been trying to record something for quite a while, and it's just been shit. So I finally thought of some ideas at last, so that's all well and good. So, um, yeah, let's hope I find some ideas quicker this time. I didn't mean to take a two-month break, but I just... As I said in other videos, I'm just going to upload when I've got an idea. I'm not going to grind out videos that are shit. 
because you could have had some videos and they were shit and there was one video that was that was good but I accidentally didn't save it so it's my idiot fault so um, if you guys want a um, give me any ideas or recommend any apps that could be good for my YouTube channel then that's cool and um, yeah I hope that you enjoyed this video and goodbye